Hello, Cancer. Thank you for watching my channel, Cancer. I want to be looking at y'all's situation. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I'm using the Rider Waite cards first to see what's happening here. For those of you interested in sage, spiritual candles, or shea butter, I have that on the website. Whew. It's a hot ass day today, you guys. Man, fucked up out here. All right, overall energy. I'm getting some conflict here. Fire energy. Ooh, Leo says Aries. Definitely seeing some growth, growth here, some victory here, and definitely, you know, the strength part. And here comes the Leo energy again. If you are dealing with Leos, you know, these people are acting super moody or super shady, you know, bad attitudes, definitely. Okay? That's what I'm picking up on the situation. They could have been acting like that in the past, and now they're acting like, you know, they all cool or something, but watch that shit, you know what I mean? Um, some of y'all may be really tripping about your money. Some of y'all have some money that you can't spend right now. Maybe you're waiting on your paycheck. Something may be going wrong with money or, you know, you're just trying to, you know, make something happen in your life right now. I see some sadness around your situation too. Now, let me clarify this, this, uh, Leo energy. Cause trust me, you know, I feel something is not right with Leo. I feel like the person has a bad attitude, definitely, okay? Some of y'all could have been waiting on this person, definitely, I, I see it. For those of you dealing with earth signs, I feel like you're not getting the justice that you wanted connected to that situation. You may have to go to court, you may have some type of issue connected to that person. That, that person could be locked up, that person might be trying to get you locked up. It just doesn't look good, Okay. Um, some of y'all might be in a relationship with that person and you feel like that person is not doing enough. You might have communicated your feelings to that person or that person ghosted you. Okay. So, what else am I seeing? These messages might be for somebody out here. You know, this is somebody's story. So, I'm going to keep on shuffling, you guys. And like I said, thank you for coming back. Thank you for the comments. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. I have a cancer rising, for those of you that don't know. Indecision here is an overall energy. <laughs> Let's see what's going on here. Power reverse, okay? The universe came along, got rid of something out of your life, all right? And I feel like you are feeling better about something now. You got over something, okay? Um, This earth energy is definitely solid in your situation, okay? Or this could be you, you know, just getting your shit together, feeling stable, okay? But a lot of you cancers are not feeling stable. I'm telling you that. There might be some ups and downs with your money, for sure. It could be a child coming in for some of you. Fire sign child. Could be a message. Could be a new adventure or something you're trying to jump into. Um, I also feel like you're being very nice to people as well. Or somebody could be nice to you. Some of y'all attract, you know, a lot of uh, water signs too. People with water in their chart. You may be running into those types. Two of Pentacles reversed. Time to let go of something, so you want to let it go. I feel like it's it has something to do with somebody that that hurts you. Okay, some of you probably knew you were in a third party, and you just like, uh, I'm done. You're over something. Okay, air energy. You got some spine energy here too. Okay, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And here's your stability here. With the four of wands, this could be someone's home, relationship. You know, this could be you guys just enjoying something. And I feel like 
a lot of cancers may be thinking about the past a lot too, or they're just feeling stuck in the past, all right? Sometimes you may want to take a break from things because you don't have any faith in it, okay? Um, Three of Cups could be some type of celebration coming up, party, something, you know, connected to your situation. Could, could be you reconciling with somebody, water sign. Could be an air sign too, okay? If you're dealing with air, I feel like that person may want to commit to you or maybe you want to commit to them, okay? Um... For those of you dealing with the air sign again, I feel like some type of conflict may go away. All right. I hear, I'm hear. i just hearing that if you were dealing with an air sign and you were arguing with them, you're not going to be arguing with them anymore. If you're dealing with an earth sign, I feel like there's some type of happiness connected to that situation. And there's definitely addictions in that situation, especially if you're dealing with a Taurus. You could be addicted to that person, they're addicted to you, or, you know, that person could have some addictions or some shit going on in their life, okay? Or maybe you got addictions. Whatever this is, somebody's overindulging in something, either you or them, okay? But listen, Ooh, it could be the other person, I feel. I really feel like it's the other person. Because I don't really feel like it's cancer. You know what I mean? I really don't. Even though it could be, but mm, not feeling it. Now, Cancer, I do see some tears. Some of y'all might have been sad, walked away from a situation, started looking at your options, okay? I also feel like this is a time when you might want to rush into things. Some of y'all might jump into a contract, just sign papers, doing something, learning something new. Um, you might jump into a new job or something, you know, a new opportunity here as well. Um, you're definitely in defense mode here. Seven of Wands in a future position here. Money might be going out the door. You know, you might not be able to spend like you want to. You might jump into situations, okay? Either you're going to help somebody or somebody comes in to help you, I feel, with the Six of Pentacles, okay? Um, I see Aries energy here, too. Somebody might be working with an Aries or somebody might just, you know, um, somebody might not like Aries too much, too. I'm picking that energy up. Um, if you were in a relationship with somebody like that, I feel like it's unrequited love there. Either you don't like them or they don't like you. I also feel like that person may be be single and just, you know, sleep around or something. Or it could be somebody you're just dating. If you're dealing with Aries, it's not going to work out, especially if it's past energy. I feel like the relationship may end completely, okay? That situation with Aries. If this reading is about an Aries. A lot of us are definitely trying to avoid uh, players that, that come in and out of our lives. So um, if you're trying to avoid that type of energy right now, definitely try to avoid fire signs, period. Okay. There may be a problem with a fire sign in your situation. A lot of cancers might have been thinking about being single recently, too. I'm picking that up. a lot of stress in your situation i see pettiness here either you're being petty or somebody else was and i also see a user in your situation too i see a moocher here definitely i feel like there's another tower coming for, for your ass some of y'all just had a tower and another one is coming okay <laughs> this tower has something to do with this person okay this earth energy here this could be a user a scammer or somebody like that um the tower is definitely, you know, put you in a position of letting something go, okay? It may be somebody with water in their chart, too, for some of you. Um, now, I look in the situation. Now, I'm looking in the future position of your situation, and I see manipulation here, okay? Either you're manipulating somebody or they're manipulating you. And this fire energy stays in reverse. Did you block somebody? Do you feel disconnected from this, this person, okay? This controlling type of energy here. Somebody might really think that they're right about something. It could be a child. It could be an adult. It's fire. Leo Sag Aries is definitely not good right now. Okay. Um, now, when it comes to the manipulation, I feel like there's heartbreak surrounded around it. There's also spies surrounded around it. And I also feel like it has something to do with a home or marriage or something like that, too. 
All right. It's all around your stability. Definitely. What's going on with Cancer? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Y'all go watch this for any placement. Some of y'all just gave up in the past. You're just like feeling like you're doing you're doing everything by yourself. You're not really interested in, you know, working on something. You had love offers, so I definitely see that. But some of you were just, you know, stopping yourself from jumping into stuff as well. All right. There's a problem here, definitely with Aries or some other fire sign. Somebody's thinking about travel, change of residence. Somebody's thinking about uh ending something too. All right, somebody might even end the thoughts of you know communicating with somebody out of state or out the country or something, or they may you know cancel their plans around this time. It's like you're thinking about it, but then some of you may just end it. Okay, a lot of you were just indecisive about you know whether you want to move or travel or connect with somebody. Okay, um, the past definitely on your mind here. The lover's card, too. We do have Gemini energy here. I've seen it twice. Just like I'm seeing this Aries energy that's, that's really fucked up. The Aries energy is too fucked up. And now I'm seeing this this Gemini energy. Do you have Gemini in your chart? Are you fucking with somebody that got Gemini in their chart? Do you need to make a choice between two people around this time? Okay. When I clarify the lover's card, it may be a Gemini for you. Okay. For some of y'all out there. Some of y'all might be dealing with twin flame energy. I see separation with soulmates as well. Okay, some of y'all might be separated from somebody because some type of truth came out here. All right, some of y'all were holding on to something for a while, but now you just see that it's a burden here. Um, some of y'all removed yourself out of a situation, and I feel like there's still some communication going on. Okay, some of y'all could be connecting with air signs. Okay, some of y'all already had some bullshit going on with an air sign. A tower moment you know what i mean like i said the tower is a reverse i feel like it was connected to this air all right now when it comes to this air person i feel like this person appears to be all successful you know doing good or whatever but i feel like there's some juggling connected to that person either that person is you know cheating or you juggled them it could go either way <laughs> um i just see a lot of different stuff going on here some of you might be nice to people even though they're acting like assholes you know what i mean <laughs> cancer someone rise and leave aside i want to switch to my other cards when i get done with these all right i'm definitely seeing love triangles in the past here too much partying here drinking attitude problems and and fighting conflict look this is like in the past situation okay we got water air and fire now, now you guys are like, you know, fuck these addictions. You know, you're like trying to remove yourself from that situation. Not committing to situations anymore. You know, not thinking about traditional things, okay? The sun reverse. I feel like there's something definitely not going well in that situation right there. Ugh. A lot of Leo energy in reverse. Very negative, okay? Um, somebody could have been in the hospital, had some health problems. Around this time as well, relationship has just gone wrong or people just jumping too fast into situations. Um, somebody might have just decided, oh, I want to be single real fast or something like that. Or somebody's dealing with Aries. I keep saying Aries here. Somebody's definitely, you know, going through a lot of financial difficulties here with the five of pentacles. Okay, stressed out, going through health problems. Okay, somebody might even have a surgery coming up or something. I just see something that's not right. There's growth here, too, with the Seven of Pentacles. All right? But I feel like something may not go your way, okay? You might not be able to pay for something real fast here. But you're healing from a situation. I definitely see that. And you're making decisions about your past, which was very negative. Now, some of you feel like you deserve more, especially with these stupid relationships that are ending around your situation. You're just like, ugh, this is not good. Okay, some of y'all are totally against something or somebody's totally against you. Harsh ener energy here with this air. Okay, it keeps seeing Gemini energy, but it could be any other air sign. Um, or anybody with Gemini in their chart. When it comes to you having a soulmate in your life, just know they come and go. 
There could be some sneakiness involved in soulmate connections. Either you're doing it or that they're doing it. Um, someone's holding on to a situation. Someone's holding on to, you know, having too much to do. You know, holding on to burdens and stuff. You know, not resting. Um, isolating themselves as well. You know what I mean? And someone's saying, oh, you know, Virgo, the hermit. If you're dealing with anybody like that, that person is very harsh or you're going to be harsh to them or the universe is just going to get rid of that person out of your life too, okay? Um, I just see some negativity here, okay? I feel like somebody's in your life to use you, but I feel like you're trying to get rid of them. Somebody doesn't have any love in their heart. Could be you or somebody else. And I keep seeing this fire energy. You know, you could be hearing from a fire sign or something like that. Um, This person may try to take your stress away. Okay, I see apologies coming in from maybe a, a, a fire sign. But I feel like when you look around your situation, like, you, listen, people might say you petty as hell for some stuff you're doing, okay? Or you may just see that somebody else being petty, okay? If there's children involved, I feel like children are definitely noticing things around them. They're seeing things are not right. And the truth is definitely going to come out. Somebody's going to see you straight through some shit, okay? Somebody might be smiling up in your face, being nice as fuck, but that person really fucked up, okay? You want to let go of them, whoever they is. Could be Pisces for somebody out there. Oh, definitely don't trust Pisces right now, okay? Do not trust it. I said I wasn't going to use these cards. <laughs> let me go into the Romance Angels. I just want to pick up five cards on the Romance Angels and... If they come out in reverse, yes, I do reverse those. So, what's happening, Cancer? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or any other placement you have in Cancer? Soulmate, okay? Yes, this person is your soulmate. You deserve love. You are lovable is in reverse. You might not be making yourself lovable to somebody right now. You might be a mad as fuck at a mug on your face or some shit like that. Separation. Maybe coming up with somebody time apart from your partners on the horizon. Um, chemistry. There is chemistry in the situation. Some strong magnetic attraction. Okay. Attraction again. Okay, there is attraction there. You attract romantic love and enjoyment. Moment fully. I am talking so fast here. Now, <laughs> let me get into my cards. If you guys want to purchase my deck from me, you can text my phone or email me and i ship between three to five business days and these cards are not on my website you have to order them from me directly because i have these cards <laughs> so yeah let's see what's going on cancer summer rising venus Stop shuffling when I feel like it's time. Definitely. At the bottom of the deck, I got a queen of swords in reverse. Do you know who that person is? It could be your energy going to fuck off on somebody or somebody doing that fucking bullshit to you. Watch out, okay? That's Gemini Libra Aquarius. Look, queen of cups in reverse too. That could be you not being, you know, nice anymore, you know, not doing what you used to do, okay? We do got the air energy again showing up here, Gemini Libra Aquarius, and we also have you definitely removing this boredom bullshit out of your life, okay? Um, some of y'all could be leaving your job. You could be taking time off of work or something like that. Some of y'all might not even have a job at all. Um, and there is definitely some of you trying to remove yourself from the home. Some of you may have gotten out of a situation because you were just so confused and you had options or something. You got so many options going on here. Seven of Cups and... Two of Wands, you know, that's about you choosing a path. Okay, so when it comes to all this shit, I feel like there is a problem here. You know, it could be your finances. It could be somebody else's. Okay, when it comes to this Earth energy, Capricorn towards Virgo. And I keep seeing decisions being made. Whatever you're making a decision about, it could have something to do with your past. You know what I mean? Um, Some of you could be let, letting the situation go. Let the situation go because too many delays, okay? Somebody might be coming back to kiss your ass, too. Somebody put water in their chart, okay? But I don't feel like you're going to jump on it, whoever this is, okay? Maybe the conflict around the situation went 
went away. So maybe this person's trying to come back in. It could be a business partner. It could be somebody you're, that's trying to learn something from you or you you learned something from, it, from them in the past. It could be somebody you married to or somebody you did business with, whoever it is. All right. All I know is that there's going to be some separation. Somebody's going to walk twice. Somebody walk. Six of Swords, Eight of Cups, and Separation. Okay. So somebody's leaving. Somebody's leaving. Okay. I'm done with this reading and I will talk to y'all later.